Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Topic is about what is uh, the blood sugar control and how do we make sure the A1C level is accurate and we are close to that. People talk about HbA1c and A1C, right? Have you started lowering your blood sugar? Maybe you have cut down coughs, stopped snacking and tried some restricted eating. Your blood glucose levels are coming down. Your A1C is dropping. That's great progress. But the big question is, what should be your A1C target really be? Is it 9, 8, 6? What should be the real target? This, this is a question most of us have. Most of us hear different answers depending upon the doctors we ask. Uh, recently, uh, I went through a surgery and uh, the physician told me, your uh, A1C is 7.8. If you bring it down to 7, it should be okay. So be happy if you stay below 7. That's what she said. And uh, some people, uh, the doctors were you know, initially telling me, you know, you have to bring it down to 6.5, you have to bring it to 6, which is excellent. But there is a problem. Those numbers are still in the diabetic range only. It is not, even if I bring down to 6.5, uh, I will be called diabetic only. So it is not uh, any great magic. Let us look at the facts. A healthy non-diabetic A1C is 5.6 or below that number. Uh, so if you are between 5.7 to 6.4, people will call you as a pre-diabetic, right? And the moment you cross 6.5, the people say you are a diabetic and they start the treatment directly. There are, in fact, people start... Uh, advising you for medication even if you cross 6. They say you are pre-diabetic, you are uh, under border control, so border range, you must uh, take care of all that. Once diagnosed, many doctors stop you encouraging uh, people to bring down their number. They suggest keeping your A1C in the 6.5 to 7.5 range. The moment you go up, they will say, you can go up to 7.5, there is no problem. Some even say 7 to 8 is reasonable. But that means your average blood sugar is 180 or more with a daily spikes of 200 plus. That's far from the healthy diet. You don't want to be getting a blood sugar spikes up to 180, 200. Okay? Uh, and as we age, it's a um, lifestyle uh, disease. As we age, uh, it may even go to 300. So doctor may say that still that may also be okay, but it's not correct. Why do doctor recommend this? Mostly out of fear for low blood sugar. Yeah, doctors are worried about your blood sugar level going low or hypos. If your A1C is too low while on strong medications or insulin, you could risk dangerous lows. To avoid lawsuits and emergencies, many doctors prefer to keep the patients a little higher. Hi guys, uh, coming back to the same topic about A1C level. But not everyone agrees. Dr. Richardson Bernstein, a type 1 diabetic himself, has kept his A1C around 4.5 for decades. He follows a strict low-carb diet and carefully manages his insulin. At 87 years old, he is leaving proof that aiming for a near normal levels is possible. He wants that even A1C of 6.5 is a double the normal blood sugar and will eventually cause damage like blindness, kidney disease, heart attack, nerve pain, etc. So, basically, we should make sure that our A1C level is under control. Okay, keep watching guys. Uh, we'll give you a good advice what should be the A1C level. Research also backs the, uh, these levels, whatever we're talking about, uh, up. Also, the research also backs up our assumptions. Every small rise in A1C increases your risk of complications. Uh, the lower the the lowest risk for heart disease is seen when an average blood sugar is around 83 milligram per deciliter. There is a A1C in the low of 5s. So what's the takeaway, guys? 
staying at 7 or 8 might be the acceptable by medical guidelines but it still leaves you are vulnerable the closer you get to normal low fives okay so the safer you are so don't be happy the doctor is saying you are seven uh, is your good eight your good no don't believe that you try to get very close to uh, normal or which is we are talking about low fives lifestyle changes like low carb eating fasting and exercise can help you to reach these numbers naturally sometimes without medication so don't worry if you feel that you are going to have hypoglycemia and uh, worried about uh, uh, the lower level of uh, sugar is more dangerous uh, don't worry about that the moment uh, your sugar level comes down and if you are uh, having hypoglycemia then you can talk to your doctor and uh, track it for whether you can bring down your medicine and improve your uh, uh, lifestyle to bring your medication down and keep your target of a1c level in the end your target a1c level is your choice but remember everything every tenth of a point uh, low reduces your risk of blindness kidney failure amputation heart attack and early death don't settle for a good enough if you can safely do a better so what is your a1c goal let me know in the uh, comments okay so what is your goal based on uh, whatever i talked about Uh, tell me your a1c goal and uh, please comment and if you find this uh, video useful don't forget to like subscribe for more practical advice guys thank you thank you for watching my uh, channel like share and subscribe